Hello and welcome to this video on Japanese encephalitis. Japanese encephalitis is a viral disease that is spread by mosquitoes, and it is prevalent in many parts of Asia. It is a serious disease that can cause inflammation of the brain and can lead to death. In this video, we will discuss the causes, symptoms, prevention, and treatment of Japanese encephalitis. Causes of Japanese encephalitis Japanese encephalitis is caused by a virus called the Japanese encephalitis virus or JEV. The virus is transmitted through the bite of infected mosquitoes, primarily the Culex mosquito. The virus is found in many parts of Asia, including Southeast Asia, China, Japan, Korea, and India. It is more common in rural areas where people are more exposed to mosquitoes. About Japanese encephalitis virus, JEV, Japanese encephalitis virus, JEV, is a single-stranded RNA virus that belongs to the Flaviviridae family. The virus is spherical in shape, with a diameter of approximately 50 nanometers. The JEV particle consists of an outer envelope made up of a lipid membrane, which is studded with viral proteins. These proteins include the envelope, E, and membrane, M, glycoproteins, which are responsible for viral entry and membrane fusion. Inside the envelope, the virus contains a capsid, which is made up of the capsid, C, protein and encloses the viral RNA genome. Reservoir host of Japanese encephalitis virus. The reservoir host of the Japanese encephalitis virus, JEV, is primarily pigs, although other animals such as wading birds and water buffalo can also serve as reservoir hosts. Pigs are highly susceptible to JEV infection and can harbor the virus in their blood and other tissues for prolonged periods without showing any symptoms. Mosquitoes that feed on infected pigs can then transmit the virus to other animals, including humans. In addition to pigs, other animals such as horses, cows, goats, and sheep can become infected with JEV, but they are not considered to be important reservoir hosts since they typically do not produce enough of the virus in their blood to infect mosquitoes. It is important to note that although pigs are the primary reservoir host for JEV, they do not develop the severe symptoms associated with the disease in humans. Therefore, it is important to implement measures to prevent the transmission of the virus from pigs to humans, such as vaccinating pigs, controlling mosquito populations, and practicing good hygiene and sanitation practices. Risk factor of Japanese encephalitis. The risk factors for Japanese encephalitis, je, include. 1. Geographic location. Japanese encephalitis is most prevalent in rural areas of Asia, particularly in areas with rice paddies, pig farms, and high mosquito populations. 2. Seasonal variation. Japanese encephalitis outbreaks typically occur during the rainy season, when mosquito populations are at their highest. 3. Occupation. Farmers, agricultural workers, and outdoor laborers are at a higher risk of exposure to mosquitoes and the virus. 4. Age. Children under the age of 15 are at a higher risk of infection and severe disease. 5. Travel. Travelers to endemic areas are at risk of contracting Japanese encephalitis if they are not vaccinated or take appropriate precautions to avoid mosquito bites. 6. Immune status. Individuals with weakened immune systems, such as those with HIV, AIDS or undergoing chemotherapy, may be more susceptible to severe disease. 7. Mosquito exposure. Exposure to mosquitoes, particularly the Culex species, increases the risk of infection with the Zha virus. Symptoms of Japanese encephalitis. Symptoms of Japanese encephalitis can range from mild to severe and typically appear 5 to 15 days after exposure to the virus. Some common symptoms include Fever. A high fever is usually the first symptom of the disease, with temperatures reaching as high as 104 degrees Fahrenheit, 40 degrees Celsius. Headache. Headaches are a common symptom of Japanese encephalitis and can range from mild to severe. Nausea and vomiting. These symptoms can occur due to the inflammation of the brain. Fatigue. Individuals with Japanese encephalitis often experience extreme tiredness or weakness. Muscle pain. Some patients may experience muscle aches and pains. Seizures. Seizures can occur in severe cases of the disease, especially in children. Confusion. As the virus attacks the brain, patients may become confused or disoriented. Coma. In severe cases, Japanese encephalitis can lead to a coma, which is a state of unconsciousness. Prevention of Japanese encephalitis. The following measures can help reduce the risk of contracting Japanese encephalitis. 1. Vaccination. The most effective way to prevent JA is through vaccination. 1. 
The vaccine is recommended for travelers to high-risk areas and for people who live in areas where the disease is prevalent. 2. Mosquito Control. Mosquito control is an essential part of preventing Zhe. 2. You can reduce the number of mosquitoes around your home by removing standing water, trimming grass and shrubs, and using mosquito nets or screens on windows and doors. 3. Personal protective measures. Personal protective measures such as wearing long-sleeved shirts and pants, using mosquito repellent, and avoiding outdoor activities during peak mosquito hours can help reduce the risk of mosquito bites. 4. Good hygiene practices. Maintaining good hygiene practices, such as washing hands frequently, can reduce the risk of infection by limiting the spread of the virus. 5. Animal control. Limiting contact with animals, particularly pigs and waterbirds, can help reduce the risk of exposure to the virus. Treatment. There is no specific treatment for Japanese encephalitis. Treatment focuses on relieving the symptoms and preventing complications. Hospitalization may be necessary for severe cases. In some cases, people may need respiratory support or intravenous fluids. Antiviral medications may be used in some cases, but their effectiveness is still being studied. Conclusion. Japanese encephalitis is a serious disease that can cause inflammation of the brain and can lead to death. It is caused by a virus that is transmitted through mosquito bites. The best way to prevent the disease is to avoid mosquito bites, and vaccination is also available. If you experience symptoms of Japanese encephalitis, seek medical attention immediately. Thank you for watching this video on Japanese encephalitis. Stay safe and healthy.